Hey beauties, it's your girl Carrie Royalty. So after that beautiful rainy day walk, <laughs> I am exhausted. Not because of the walk itself, but because of the fact that I had to sit in traffic for a very, very, very long time. Nonetheless, I, I did find the, the vegetarian restaurant that I was in search of and the day was beautiful actually so many things happened but I won't get into that aspect of it but the traffic was hectic and then I had a meeting on my way home I had to stop off go to that meeting and then I'm finally home I haven't eaten anything I did buy the food at the vegetarian restaurant that I said I would but I didn't get the chance to eat anything so well I did buy a muffin from them and I took a piece of that and so um, that held me until now but the actual food itself I didn't get to eat until now so I think it's sometime after eight or so um, the place is called newly newly vegetarian um, restaurant it's at Lane Plaza Ligony there you go if you want the contact number you can call them so you'll get some good vegetarian food well I I haven't tasted what the food itself tastes like but the muffin I like it it's a banana nut muffin it has let me show you this is the muffin I did eat some from it <laughs> let me see if I can get it out of the bag I actually have the camera in my other hand so forgive me it's gonna be be a bit awkward but pretty much this is the muffin and I ate some some of it it's really good it's very nutty and for it to be whole wheat muffin it's good the spices are in there it's moist it's good it's a bit pricey for a muffin you're looking at like 300 almost 350 dollars for the muffin but the taste of it i would say it's worth it so i had some of that in the bus along with some rice crackers that I, that i had bought beside a health food store beside the restaurant and so that helped me until now but i actually bought what is called a double a double is a trini dardian food they call it a trini double it's like a pizza bread or some flatbread of some sort with chana aka chickpea um, with some chutney and some other stuff mix up but it's a it's a it's a trini favorite just like you know we have you have jamaican favorite dish this is one of um like not favorite dish but jamaican favorite snack which would be um patty they have their their trini favorite which is called a double so it's wrapped up in foil paper if you get a hole cut in half i gave my son half already he ate it and now he's fast asleep and so I don't have no cameraman, so I have to be using my one hand and filming as well. But I want to bite into this and let you guys know what it tastes like, actually. So you can know if it's, it's, a, if it's a restaurant worth going to, a vegetarian restaurant. I'm happy to know that you can actually go around Jamaica these days and find some good vegetarian restaurant that doesn't have boring food, but some real good tasting food. All right, see if I can get this up. Awesome. It's a bit soggy. You and my hand is um, a bit messy as well. All right, so it's a bit soggy because I've had it there for the whole day, but this is what it looks like. And I'm going to dig into it. I did pray before, guys, but hey, Lord bless this meal and thank you for your love. Amen. Mmm. Mm-hmm. The curry, wow, oh. the curry is quite Indian. You taste the flavor and then you have the sweet taste of the plum chutney. And then the chickpea is so soft and then the, the bread, the flat bread. Mm. This is good. Wow. This is really good. All right, so I'm gonna eat the rest of that off camera. You don't wanna see all of this get down in that, right? The ambience of the restaurant is quite good. It's like a takeout sort of vibe. Um, the food is good. 
they have a wide variety of um, meals to choose from. They have snacky meals like patties and you have the wraps and other stuff. And then you have the cooked food so you can get a stew or a lintel. This and you have soup. They have shakes. They have all sorts of um, variety to choose from. So I did ask the cashier what's the best option. What, what, what is it that people come and ask for mostly at the restaurant. And so she told me it's the double. So it's delicious. And... I'm not sure if, I don't think they do delivery, but I know they're open from Monday to Saturday or something of that, sorry. And I, I'm not sure of the closing time either. But the food is delicious, guys. One thing I was surprised about, the price is not too bad. It's not cheap and it's not really in, in it's not really expensive. It's, it's in between. But they had this chocolate cake. They say that it's dairy free and it was um, dairy free and something else. And I tell you, my mouth was watering, but I'd already spent enough money and I didn't want to pay $550 for um, a slice of chocolate cake that's, you know, vegetarian chocolate cake. They did use sugar to sweeten to make the icing, but I tell you, the chocolate cake sell off. So the next time I'll be going, I'll definitely be grabbing a slice of that chocolate cake. But my review on the um, New Life restaurant, vegetarian restaurant, it's a it's a it's a yes for me. I, I really love it. I give it a eighty percent, eighty five there about. I will try and do a video. I will try and do a video um on it at the actual place to do you know just one of my live videos like I can normally do. I just wanted to reach out to you guys to you know share with you the experience from eating at New Life vegetarian restaurant, and it's definitely a yes for me. Guys, I'm tired, so I'm going to go now. I just wanted to just bring bring that to you guys. So I'll see you and just remember to be bold, be, to be beautiful and be natural. And just give God thanks, you know, for everything. He's worthy. Today was a wonderful day, you know, though the traffic was horrible. The other things that happened during the course of the day were great experiences. And I just want to give God thanks for that. Enjoy your life and make the best of it and give God thanks in good times and in bad. Until then guys, take care.